Listen to Ephesians chapter 1, verse 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. Wow. Well, the song tells us to count your many blessings, name them one by one. So let's see for the next couple of days what spiritual blessings that Paul mentions in these next few verses. Here's verse 4. Just as he chose us in him before the foundation of the world, that we would be holy and blameless before him. He chose us. Jesus said earlier, you did not choose me, but I chose you. It may come as somewhat of a surprise to you, but I've always been small. And that means that when I was a kid and my friends were choosing sides for sports, I would usually be picked last. That's just the way it was. Maybe small people or people who have lived with rejection all their lives can best appreciate what it means to be chosen. I do. And to be chosen by God himself. And to be chosen from before the foundation of the world. Before I had a chance to play the game of life before I had the chance to demonstrate whether I had the skills or not, he chose me for his side. I definitely don't have the skills to play the game of life, certainly not in holiness and blamelessness that verse 4 speaks about. So it's a really, really good thing that he chose me first. I hope he doesn't regret the choice he made. Verse 5. He predestined us according to adoption as sons through Jesus Christ to himself, according to the kind intention of his will. He determined beforehand that we should be his children through Christ. Speaking to Christians now, of course. That we should be his children through Christ. This was his kind intention. Verse 11 says that we were predestined according to his purpose, who works all things after the counsel of his will. Think of it. The kind God, whose purpose it was to speak the universe into being, also spoke life and adoption into the lives of his children Amazing grace. How sweet the sound. And we've just started here on the list of blessings that we are to count. Let's keep counting our blessings tomorrow, shall we? See you then.